Hi, this is Nikki, and I'm here to share the messages that I get from Spirit and from all of our higher selves on this journey to love. And so the message that I want to share today is somebody asked for letters 10 and 19 to be read uh, out for them. So uh, this is from the Divine Love Letter Mantra. This is the mantra book that I do. And 90, the 19 one is, our vibration is like a thousand rainbows smiling down on earth. And so when I saw that, I was like, okay, well, again, I can see why that message has come through because there's been lots of messages around the rainbow and especially over the Scorpio moon, the message was very clearly to run through a sprinkler and imagine that water tickling you like a rainbow with rainbow light. And so that's why this was so perfect because it is our vibration is like a thousand rainbows smiling down on earth. Repeat, 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 repeat. So um, just a really nice way. Again, I can see that all of these messages are all coming from our higher selves to say, do this because this is what I want you to do to keep your energy vibe high and for us to help come into our reunion. And so uh, letter 19 from the love letter books is book one. And this is, I want to say that this life that we're going to create together is going to be so beautiful and so full of love and romance and passion. A passion for life and a passion to have the best life we can with each other. Taking care of each other, being there for one another, being each other's best friend, their home, their comfort and their challenge. I want that for us beyond anything else in the whole world. I want all my boyhood dreams to come true of running off with the love of my life, living the dream and never, ever, ever looking back. Believing that the two of us can do anything we set our minds and our hearts to. I want us, full stop. That's what I want more than anything. Us, 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 to come together in a beautiful, passionate glow and flame of love. Oh, it actually just makes your heart melt a little bit every single time. Um, and so, letter 19 from book two is this. My love, I'm sorry that we have to go through this phase in our journey, but it's necessary for us to find our path back to each other to understand our truth, to find who we are in the light of each other's love. We only know this by separating and seeing that in another's light, we are in our shadow. It is only our love, our light that allows us to fully shine. We are discovering our light. Our love is incredibly powerful and will bring us home once again. We will end in each other's love to find our light. Well, that's really lovely because that's sort of saying, look, whatever karmic partners we're with at the moment, we're doing that to so we can understand our light even more. Um, so that's book three. And then book two, letter 19, is this, which is, you're the light of my life, the pink in the sunset over a beautiful calm sea, the sun coming up on a summer's day. You are the reason I am here, the reason I am alive. The reason why we are both alive is to find each other, to love each other with every inch of our souls, every fibre of our being, everything about us has been made to love each other. It's in our DNA, it's our blueprint. It's literally written into every cell of our body that we are each other's perfect match. There isn't anyone on the earth that can do what you do to me or what I do to you. There is only us that can fulfill our soul's desire. Well, again, this is crazy because yesterday when I was doing healings for people, uh, quite a lot, I kept seeing pink sunsets in the background. <laughs> and so, um, yeah, this is lovely. And this is, again, this is why it's so perfect because basically... This is showing, you know, the the second one was about the um, saying, look, we're with, with other people, but it's making us realise what we truly want. 
And then this is saying, look, it's in our DNA. We are each other's absolute perfect match. So, yeah, quite, again, just gorgeous. Uh, so letter 10 is this from book two. Um, well, that's a silly question, isn't it? What do you think? Of course I am. That's the whole reason we agreed to do this whole insanely difficult and painful journey. The only prize at the end is living in truly ecstatic, blissful sexual ecstasy. Otherwise, why would we have chosen this life? Believe me, it is beyond what your mind can imagine. It is literally the most sublimely exquisite feeling that you can ever imagine your body to possess. Possessing each other's souls into our physical bodies and merging together is the most beautiful experience we came for. Well, <laughs> that told you. <laughs> wow. Oh, that was a very cool letter. Uh, okay. So <laughs> That gives us all something to look forward to then. Uh, I love that. It's like, seriously, why else would we be doing this? You know, if we're not going to get some sexual gratis gratification at the end of this, frankly, very tricky journey, then I love that because I say, what would be the point? <laughs> okay, so letter 10. And this is a child's guidance. Um, I want to help you on your journey to love to find true love and to unlock the secrets of what we came here for. We came here to be a union of love, a union of pure divine love, a love that this planet hasn't seen before. We are the new wave of love givers that are here to show the world that love really is the only answer, that love is the only reason why we come to remember to love and to be love. It's not to try and be anything, but it's to remember the beautiful soul essence that we all are. We all come from the same source of a divine spark. That is our journey, to find oneness with all. Well, again, just kind of beautiful, right? Child's guidance, I especially love uh, future children, children's guidance. I mean, it's just, it feels very, very special. Um, Okay, and letter 10 from book one is this, and it is, I want to tell you that you are everything to me. You are my world, the engine in me that makes my heart keep beating, the tick in my clock. I love you with every part of me. I worship you with my love and cannot wait for the day that we can live this beautiful love affair out together. Living, loving, touching feeling our way through this beautiful life to create the most wonderful life together. That is my dream. That is our agreement that we made with each other, that we would do this. This crazy life, we would make it together. A beautiful, peaceful, loving life. We will have a beautiful existence. Okay, well, notice that this letter says, uh, the engine. You, I want to tell you that you are everything to me. You are my world, the engine in me. Okay, so again, it relates to healing that I did yesterday. So I'm just going to explain it because again, it just is very, um, uh, very powerful visual to understand what's going on. So I see, I keep three. So basically I see a white van a traffic light and a seashore, you know, like when the sea comes in and it's going in and out and in and out. And I hear three different songs and it's like it's flashing between the different images. So the songs were The Tide Is High by Blondie. Um, I think it was uh, Madness, It Must Be Love, which was coming through a couple of times yesterday for different people. Uh, so It Must Be Love by Madness. And another song, which has just gone out of my head. But anyway, the significance of it was, was that basically he was saying what his, his energy was telling me was that he said, look, when you first learn to drive and you put the key in the engine and you have to take your foot, you basically have got it in gear and you're going to take your foot off the brake and put it on the accelerator. 
uh, the first time that you ever do that, you're filled with this firstly excitement because you're starting to get your freedom, right? And you're about to go driving and it's like you're growing up and you're coming of age and all that sort of stuff. But equally, that there is that real sense of fear when you're about to put your foot on the accelerator and go. Because uh, he said that one thing is for sure, once you put the accelerator down, that's it, right? You are going. And so that is the feeling at the moment. That's what he said. Um, but basically, then it was the reason why it was coming in with the sea. And it basically was saying it's just as sure, just as certain as the as the shore comes in and out and the tide comes in and out, then um, we will be together. And then the song, The Tide is High, uh, by Blondie and the and the and that was obviously very clearly a message to the lady to say, listen, the tide is high, but I'm holding on. I'm going to be your number one. And so again, very very powerful way of of not only saying what's happening, but also to give guidance about what needs to be done, and that is literally to keep holding on. So it was very powerful again, an amazing way of you know, and just as like the stop the stoplight as well. I mean. You know, we have no control over those traffic lights. They go when they go. And so, again, this symbology and the power behind that was that saying that that is completely out of our control. You can't control a stop and start light. That is linked to a greater network that and we don't know how, you know, that all happens, but it does. So, again, very, very powerful. Um, so... If you would like to have a healing or a reading, that's where I tap into your energies and I can see everything like I um, just explained. And it will be whatever your highest good wants to know in your twin. Um, and if you want that, I'm doing three for two, so £22 each. Details in the link. Um, like I say, if you want to get these books, then this is the best way to get messages <laughs> to stay on track with your twin. Because honestly, they are quite amazing. Uh, letter uh, the one twenty. Uh, sorry, no, number ten is this. I am the root of the tree that feeds the universe with love. I am the root of the tree that feeds the universe with love. So, every morning, this is what I do. I literally read through all of these, and uh, I just repeat, repeat, repeat. Because what it does is it just lifts and shifts your energy and moves you in that space of listening and tapping into your twin to get, you know, numbers. And then you're like, OK, well, I just heard you wanted me to see, look at number seven or whatever it is. Just a way of doing it, right? Um, so the other thing was, like I said, I'm going to start donating one letter, channeled letter a day. Um, please only use, the, the letters are only $10 anyway. So I'm doing a donation a day for anyone that is really, really financially challenged, obviously, <laughs> um, who really needs some help. So if you've already had letters, then I would rather give it to somebody that hasn't had a letter that really needs help. And also is in under financial struggle because $10 is not very much. So I really want you to use your, uh, you know, make sure it's going to the right person let's say okay so I'm going to start doing that so the thing that you need to do is put a gold star into the comments the first person to put that gold star in um, I will then contact you um, I will then respond in the comments and so you get uh, uh, all I need is your twin's name and I'll do a letter. So that's a letter a day I will donate um, to the need, so the, the, the person that needs it the most. And I'm totally trusting you um, in your, you know, and basically doing that. All right. Well, I hope that helps. Take care. Have a great day. Bye.